Hey, Buddha bless. But Hi. Buddha bless. Ba, na, 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 na. So did you, have you ascended yet? Nam Nam Yo Choyo. It's Nam Yo Renge Kyo. It's Nam Yo Renge Kyo. Yeah, yeah, there is. Nam Yo Renge Kyo. Nam Yo Renge Kyo. You call me a nappy head hoe? What you say? You think you, there's a black people over here? You can't call nobody nappy head hoe. Oh, I got over here. She, she said nappy head hoe. No, oh, man. So, what do you want to tell us, Buddha? Hmm? Okay. Go well, I, I think what you are doing, correct mm -hmm. me if I'm wrong, is trying to get women to be more respectful to men? No. Okay. What I'm trying to do is help women understand what the kind of men they want, want from a woman. Can you help me? What kind of man do you want? I want a nice, uh, responsible man. Um, I want a family man, a businessman, a man who likes to read. Pray. A man who likes to read and do what? Pray. You want a family man, a nice man, a responsible man, a man who likes to pray, a businessman, a man who likes to read? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. How old? Um, under 40. That's a big, that's a big age range. Oh, above 25, 28. How old are you? 28. You want children? I want them. How many? Um, three to five. What state do you live in? New York. City? New York. New York State or New York City? New York City in New York. Okay. Do you want to be a stay-at-home wife? Yes, but I like to work. Mm -hmm. Did you go to college? Yes. Did you finish college? Finish is like PhD or finish Finish is like bachelor's, graduate. I have a bachelor's. In what? Education. Okay, so you're broke. All right. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're broke. Yeah, you're broke. And how, many, how much money would a man need to make in New York City to raise a family of five, have a wife and him, so seven people? Well, I don't have to stay here. But okay, but you're going to have to meet him there, so we start. Okay, a lot. I don't even know. That's the problem. See, when I asked you what you want a man, you said all these things, but then it gets right down to it. And you ladies really want a lifestyle that comes attached to money. How much does it cost to have five kids when the average child in this country is around $300,000 per kid, middle class? Do you want your kids to go to college? Of course, but I don't know much hold about on, Hold on, hold on. Do you want to be able to travel uh, domestically and internationally with your family? Yes. Okay, so you're talking about kids that are $500,000. You want $2.5 million worth of kids plus you and him. How much would your husband need to make since you're going to be a stay-at-home wife? Um, like you said, millions. Right. So that's much more than a nice man, a businessman, a family man, a man who prays, a man who likes to read. You want a rich man. Because he has to be rich and then all those other things, ma'am. I, I listen very well and I pay, I, I'm too good at what I do. Don't play. You want a rich man. How tall are you? 5'11". Dress size. 10. How much did you weigh the last time you weighed yourself? 190. Okay. Um, on a scale from 1 to 10, fresh face out of the shower, your natural face, what would you rank it? Just your face. You can't use 7. Um, 8. Beyonce's an 8. I know. So you up there with Beyonce? Yeah. I didn't get out the shower just now. Okay. Take sure. off your glasses. Mm, you're cute. I'll give you a six. You're not okay. up to Beyonce. You're trying to, you're I don't trying have to Beyonce's money cute. either. Excuse me? Excuse me? I don't have Beyonce's money either. Well, Beyonce didn't have Beyonce's money until she earned it. But you're not an eight. You're, I mean, Beyonce's an eight. Louise an adjustable six. You're a six. You're cute. It's not a bad thing. You're cute. But 
it all comes down to an equation. At what point in life did a six foot tall, 200 pound cute woman ever get rich me? But I'm not 200 pounds. 190 is 200 pounds. And I'm not 60 tall. Hey, 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 hey. You're disagreeable, Buddha. The energy is all wrong. I'm just asking. Because you asked me, you said, can I help you? And I'm trying to help you. And the first thing is reality. Wherever you think you rank is where you rank. Do you have millionaires, rich men trying to marry you right now? I don't talk to enough people to know. That's an answer, no. OK. So what you qualify for, what any cute woman qualifies for, is an average man. An average man in this country, do you care if he's black or do you care what race he is? I prefer him to be black. Okay, the average black man in this country earns $41,500. That's 20, roughly $22 an hour or $21 an hour. That's what you qualify for. And you have a degree in education. You're five foot 11, 190. After five kids, you will gain an additional 20 pounds per kid, roughly. 20 to 50. I'm giving you the low end of the scale. So by the time you get rid of those five kids, one, two, three, four, you're going to at least have another 50 to 60 pounds of baby weight on you. That's going to put you every bit of, yes, ma'am, you will. Because you're not, first of all, this is not my first rodeo. What is the, when was the last time you were a dress size four? Um, elementary school. Thank you. So thank, <laughs> thank you. You don't have a track record of being in shape. So you're not going to all of a sudden snap back. This is as good as it gets. So five kids, an additional 60 pounds. That's going to put you right at 250. Five foot 11, 250, five kids, average woman. I can't, be, I will never be 250, Kevin. After five children, you'd be lucky if you're only 250. I'm an educator. I know how to handle kids. It's not that. But you don't seem to know how to handle a treadmill or a diet. Why aren't you 145 pounds right now, educator? I think that I'm going to go now. Hey, you, you need to go to the gym. I do, but... Um, okay, yeah. okay, you asked me, and I just told you, and you act like I'm offending you with the reality. And here's the thing, I want you guys to understand, reality is offensive to women because she wants five kids. She wants five no, kids and she I wants to get that. She would like to be a stay-at-home wife. And I didn't judge either way. I didn't judge either way, man. But you asked, and I said, all right, how much would a man need to make? You said, I don't know. And that's a problem, educator. How can you get something in this life that you don't even know? How can you get I didn't man? say I need five. I said three to five. Three to five. Three to five, three to five is two more than your broke ass can afford. You can't afford one. I also said I uh -huh. was yeah. to Yeah, this is the booty, y'all. See, here comes Buddha. Mm -hmm. Here comes but Buddha right here. This is the boss bitch Buddha right here. Buddha, namaste. Namaste, go away. I don't say that. Namaste, go away. I don't do that. Have, have fun another day. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I mean, why are you upset with me? Five, four, I'm five foot 11. Okay, I'm a 200 pounds, I'm only 190. That's a sandwich and a good dump. See, and that's the reality. Women, can, women do not like the truth, they wanna be lied to. Yes, you're five eleven. Yes, you want three to five kids in New York City as an educator, yes, 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 you can have it all. Your kids will have college and you can travel domestically, internationally, and all you have to do is pray to Buddha. It'll all happen. And yes, you will not only, she is going to be a woman that has babies and loses weight. Nicole, Nicole Murphy, with your fine ass, Nicole Murphy, she, gonna, she said, I'm going to look better than Nicole Murphy after I start having babies. Nicole Murphy was thin before she started. Let's go ahead. Hey, Jeff, remember I told you about Nicole Murphy? Yeah. Uh, Nicole Murphy, shall we? Shall we? Shall we, since you want to talk shit, lady, you got the right one. You should have, you should have played nice. That's a five foot 10 woman with four or five kids. 
You see what she's doing? It's called exercise. You see what she's doing? It's called exercise. It's called exercise. When's the last time you did that other than exercise your mother flipping mouth? What is she doing? Let's see, I take my protein shakes and all other kind of shit. You know, that's a woman who, you talk about you at eight, sorry. No, no, you're not on this level. And she's 50 and is already done what you said. She's still working out. This is what's wrong with that bad bitch, boss chick, about time, Lizzo ass energy. Chill, chill my ass. <laughs> I'm going to go. Go ahead. Go on ahead. See? See that, see that thing right there, man? That's called a midriff. You ain't seen one of them since your ass was like going to recess, getting chocolate milk and chasing ice cream. <laughs> God damn it. Oh. You ain't seen one of them since your ass was on the monkey bars doing seesaw. <laughs> All right, Nicole, tell us something. Nicole Murphy, be like, I do not like this guy. I do not endorse any of this shit this guy is talking about. He's using my name in vain. I'm going to hit him with the power of the gray eyes. I'm going to use my dark side omega beams and hit this motherfucker with the power of the gray eyes. Don't kill me, Nicole. Don't kill me. I'm just using it for an example, you know. We're cool. The tall ass. That one was tall, man. I only weigh 190 pounds. I'm not going to be 250. I know how to. Ha I know how to handle kids. I know. I know how to work with kids. I know how to deal with kids. Whatever the hell you said. Or sort of guy, and you and you wonder why, you know, whether you like me or dislike me, why programs like mine are needed, because. It doesn't matter. The relevant amount of uh, delusion in the average modern woman is palpable. To the point to where you're mad at me because your ass decided to, you know, go to Chick-fil-A and get the Dunkin' Donuts. I didn't do that to you. Stop going to fucking White Castle. I didn't do it to you. Robuto will help me. I'm sorry. I didn't do it. Ain't my fault. <laughs> oh my God. They're like, Kevin, that was unnecessary. You did not have to do that to that girl. You should have just left her alone. Why? You see what she did? Acting crazy. All right, y'all. I got to get up out of here. Uh, we're going we're gonna, to, on the way out, we're going to, hold on. Hold on. We're going to have to give her the power of, okay, hold on. Let me, let me do it for you. We're going to have to do it for you. Uh oh. We're going to have to give her the power of, uh, uh, I'm going to hell. But y'all coming with me, damn it. I'm going to hell and y'all are coming with me. On the way out, we're going to have to give her the power. Holla, holla. We're going to have to give her the power. The 511, 510 power of Nicole Murphy. There you go. That's what, you, that's what you're reaching for. That's namaste, num num, yorengeo, choyo. There you go. When I grow up, I want to weigh just like this. When I grow up, I want to be just like this. If I can just pray and focus, the Buddha will help me enlighten myself to lighten my big ass. <laughs> the Buddha will help me enlighten myself to lighten my big ass up to where I ain't no more, close to being 200 pounds. I will be enlightened so I can float across the frothy, ocean water and go through with a two-piece bikini at 50 years old. We're going to pray to the Buddha God, Nicole Murphy, so I can be like this, so I can get a rich man. Nam nam nirenge ocheyo, namaste. <laughs> oh my God, damn it. You fucking with me? You fucking with the best.